The topic, and we've talked about it a lot tonight, Russia. What exactly have Trump and Pence said about their support for him and their leaders? Let's have a listen to Tim Kaine tonight. The newly, newly emboldened the aggression of Russia, whether it was in uh, Ukraine or now you, you their heavy-handed approach. You, you, you both their heavy-handed approach. You, you both have said Vladimir Putin well, is a better we're hanger get to than Russia the in just a moment. Yeah. Uh, but I do want to get back to the. But in the midst, that, in the midst, yeah, Elaine, no, but, thank you, but, thank you, but, but, thank you, Elaine, thank you, Senator. These guys have praised yeah. Vladimir Putin as a yes, great leader. How, how can they that, defend Senator. that? You heard that there, the claim, Senator Kane attacking both Trump and his running mate Pence for their praise. Of Vladimir Putin. So let's look at what Trump and Pence have said. Let's start with the Republican nominee. At the Commander in Chief Forum just last month, Trump said that Putin has, quote, very strong control over his country. He went on. Let's have a listen. He is really very much of a leader. I mean, you can say, oh, isn't that a terrible thing? He called him. I mean, the man has very strong control over a country. Now, Pence denied tonight that he praised Vladimir Putin, but fact is, he's made similar comments and more than once about Putin's leadership in Russia when backing up his running mate's comments. Have a listen to Mike Pence. I think it's inarguable uh, that Vladimir Putin has been a stronger leader in his country than Barack Obama has been in this country. So the verdict here, and this is a pretty straightforward one, because remember the claim from Senator Kane was simply that Pence and Trump had praised Vladimir Putin. We heard it, and it was more than those times you heard tonight. We rate this one as true.